and Ariel's Palutena. Showing some good skill earlier on. Looks like they are just standing still. Uh, looks like they are playing. I guess no one likes to do hand warmers. Okay. Alright. Let me see here, what's the next map? So next map oh I do want to commentate Cory versus Matt. I may I may step off for this one to kind of save my Do you wanna commentate that one? Or I mean I feel like I, it's a I good think one it's, to commentate. It's fun. Yeah, the commentate Yeah. Um, and then the next round would be when I Yeah. Oh that's true. So, so I guess we can see if anyone else wants to commentate this one. Okay. No, I'm good with that. Okay. Alright. Um, I can also announce it. For anyone who wants to commentate this match, Corey, who is uh, clearly intoxicated, may be a danger to those around him. I do believe he wants to commentate a match. This is his wife playing versus Andre Huaman, who is um, coming here alone tonight, but coming off for blood. Taking the first stock right here, shooting those guns. Backing up some percentage right now. Ariel's putting on that shield. Andre's just gonna try dash attack and F smash. That will really take out chunks of those shields. Right now, some rolls here. Pummel. Covers down tilt. There we go. Looks to be pretty even. If Ariel had an SD, I believe we would see a pretty close game right here. But for right now, we see an up smash. Taking Palutena to her last stop. Ariel grabbing the middle of the stage, trying to hug the ghost that is Patrick Swayze. Going right here, forward air. Trying to take control of that center stage. Now we seem like we have a new challenger approaching. It's none other than Mr. Corey Wu. You were calling me belligerent and drunk. <laughs> and a lightweight. I didn't I'm, say lightweight. I'm here to tell you. You're goddamn. <laughs> You're goddamn right. <laughs> Say my name. <laughs> All right, I'm drinking some eggnog while I observe this match. That is the good mm. pre-warm up drink. Mm -hmm. Calms the nerves versus your next opponent. Matt. Yeah. How do you feel about that game? Um, which one? Uh, uh, Matt Byers, Jacob. Uh, Matthew Sadlowski. Um. I'm, now, how cheesy are you going to go? Are you going to go craft cheddar? Or are mm -hmm. you going full 24-year-old age Swiss from yep. South Florida, France? I'm, I'm going imported Belgian cheese made out in the uh, the pastures of, uh, of you know, of, of France and then, and then aged in Belgium. I'm going super, super, super cheesy because it's the only way I could possibly meet Matt. There we go. I don't know if Matt, who doesn't like cheese, doesn't like melted cheese at least. Mm -hmm. Gonna have too much to handle right Hopefully there. Hopefully, it's too much for him. We'll see how he's presenting. Anyways, anyways, let's focus on this match. Oh, We've got a three stock. Andre three stocking Ariel. Not a great start. What a lame pose. All right, move on. Did you expect that? Game one. No. That was a pretty impressive show right there. I'm seeing what's going to be happening for game two. I was hoping Ariel would put up more of a fight because we expected Andre to pick the, you know, the standard Kirby. That is his bread and butter. But he did it! He chose Bayonetta. I think he's going Bayo again? I don't know. I think he's trying to find Kirby a little bit lost. He's trying to fake us out. He's going Steve? He's going Steve? Steve. I don't know about this. Okay. I think All right. Start it up! Let's see how this goes. Start it up! Alright, we have Steve. Okay, now, I am almost positive Andre has zero experience with Steve. I am quite positive that this might be his very first time playing, considering <laughs> he just did the up B, which does no damage, only makes you very vulnerable. Now, right now, he's just keep going for those forward smash. No. He doesn't even know the what Steve does, which is mine. I don't know if he knows how to mine. <laughs> no one told him. Oh, he's going for the cart! Okay. Now, if Ariel can make the most of this match, she can even things out, make it a, a good one-to-one. -one. She can even this out. Because Andre clearly doesn't know what he's doing. Just don't run into that. Don't run into those those uh, those charge, charge attacks. Those Charizards. That's those Charizards. First edition hollows. Yep. 
Okay, Ariel, running off the side, trying to trying to make things a little more even for Andre, because she knows she'll cream him. Okay. She's preparing I the cream see. right there. Yeah. Andre laying Look, Andre face down. Andre laying down. Yep, little yeah. little lava. Okay. He's figured out his favorite move is mm. down smash and up smash. Mm -hmm. down smash Ariel, up me! <laughs> Too late! Again, yeah. it's that... That pesky up B sure does get her sometimes. Well, unfortunately, we can hear okay. screaming right now in the player room. Absolutely losing her mind. Now, a little scared right here. She's making her opponents think that if they can get her off the edge, it's all over. Now, it could have been all a ruse. She actually has pretty good movement. Her movement is great. <laughs> I'm like, wow, okay. Like, does she, does she never, play this game very often? You never know what she's going to do. She practices about... about Seven hours a day. Oh, okay. You know, it's pretty standard for... Right yeah, after she go. gets home from work. Yeah, she uh, she starts up the Switch and plays... <laughs> <laughs> what does she play, Corey? I, I don't think she's playing Switch. So. Well, we are professionals right here. Corey is incapacitated. Hit his limit. Blacked out momentarily. He's trying to regain consciousness right now. He's back. I'm drunk. He is full-on wasted right now. Corey, is there anyone you would like to shout out on the stream? Family, friends? Mom, Dad, if you could be here right now, you could see how well my wife is playing right now. And you would be proud of the woman I chose as my partner. Indeed. She doesn't know how to up B, though. You're going to have to have a talk to her about that one tonight. Should have been in the vows of the marriage. I will learn how to up B. I'm playing Super Smash Ultimate. Okay. Game three. Here we go right now. King K. Rule. You are a seasoned King K. Rule main. I am. I am. What is Andre seems to have watched some of my gameplay and is attempting to use some of the same moves as I used. Now, we'll see if he can uh, do so quite as pro proficiently as I do. Um, it seems Ariel doesn't know how to respond. Aerial incredible in the air a little too long a little too long Andre coming back to the stage throwing okay. his crown doesn't like to uh, mm -hmm. leave without it because he is bald That is quite unfortunate now, for King K. Rool's character. the thing about King K. Rool is he's very easy to play very easy what is the bread and butter of King K. Rool? Mitch I think you know the answer to this it's that damn crown and that damn musket all right Range. Range all day. Wait, is this game 2 or game 1? This is game 3, my friend. Oh, I'm sorry, I meant to say it's really game 1 too. This is game 3. Alright, Andre. If Ariel keeps taking mitts to the face, she's gonna lose. She's got Ariel three doesn't know five. how to up B, and it's all over. That was a close one. Andre is the winner. He moves on to the losers.